problem. Oh my god, this is a breakthrough. Everybody, you gotta tweet me. <clears throat> tweet me at hashtag a billion girls live stream and let me know that you can see me. If you can, this is like, this is exciting. I've never done a live stream without a problem. Let's see. Let me know if you can hear and see me. Hello. <clears throat> if you can hear and see me, tweet me. Touch my body. Ticka ticka, touch my body. If you can't, then, you know, obviously, don't do that. You wouldn't know how to do that anyway. You guys are saying that you can see me, but I'm not going to believe it until you say, Touch my body. Ticka ticka, touch my body. <clears throat> I'm waiting, I'm waiting, I'm waiting, I'm waiting. I'm waiting for the my body tweets. Ooh, yes. Oh, you can see me. Shout out to Jamie Lee or Brad I Beg. I wonder if there's any more touch my body tweets. Touch my body. Yep. You guys can see me. Okay. I already like got a bunch of people up that I was going to follow. That I saw tweeting. Billion girls. That they've pre-ordered it. Chloe Ball. Boom. Follow. Rachel Hill. Boom! Also followed. <clears throat> so, uh, the Billion Girls video is out. I think it's on Vivo right now. Let's have a look. Uh, YouTube.com slash Elia Fox Vivo. Is it up? Is it up? Oh, wow, it's up! It's got one view! <laughs> Guys, it's actually up. It's got one view and seven likes. Hmm, that, was, that was obviously just me or someone at Vivo. <laughs> oh, it's up. Oh, I've not seen it on YouTube yet. Check that out. Check that out. Oh, it looks so cool. If I do say so myself. I'm kind of in the dark. I don't know why. I kind of like it. I'm in a hotel in Dublin right now. And, uh, ticka ticka touch my body. My body. I'm gonna. I don't know whether to watch the video and get you guys to watch it with me or just talk to you. I don't know. I kind of want to watch a video, but then again, I can do that anytime. I want to talk to you, baby. Baby. Uh, hey, someone likes my hat. Thanks. I was actually meant. Do you want to know a funny story about this hat? I really like this hat, <clears throat> and it actually belongs, it belong, it belonged to my, my uh, late granddad, as they call it, and uh, he used to wear a lot of cool hats, and this is one of them, and I really liked it, so I've worn it quite a bit, like, I just didn't wear it, I stopped wearing it for about, maybe a year, I haven't worn it for about a year now, yeah, but, um, yeah, and, and then I was going to wear it for a Billion Girls music video. And stupidly enough, I left it at home in my bedroom and asked my dad because I really wanted it in the video. I like the sentiment and it looked really cool. I was going to wear it for the bits like where I'm holding my guitar and walking like right at the start. But my dad FedExed it and it was a two day shoot and it arrived on the second day. And we were totally done with that scene. So it kind of. It's a bit annoying. It did, and it cost him like. 70 pounds to FedEx out. I still need to pay him for that. If he's watching, I'm sorry, I, I will pay you. That was very nice of you to do that. <laughs> you think we should watch it together? Sorry, I've been just talking about a hat. Yeah, let's watch a video. Everybody, if you go on to, I should tweet 
the link. Or should I? I don't know. Everybody, if you're watching this, go right now to youtube.com slash Vivo. Let's watch it. I'm going to put this mother on 720 HD. Okay. Okay. I'm watching it. I'm watching it. I'm watching it. I'm watching it. It's really quiet. In the world, but there's only one. Could you? That makes me feel like character named to. Gina. How could you? So baby, hey, when I tell you, it's true. There's a billion girls in the world, but there's only one. Yo, yo, there's a billion girls. A billion girls. There's a billion girls in the world. Well, actually, there's like three point something billion. Yo, yo. Shut up, all. Sure, Sean Paul is a feature. Yo yo, Iwig and Sean Paul, Iwig. Have you noticed he always seems to say something that sounds like Iwig? Iwig and Sean Paul. Iwig, I should wait. I've got an Iwig in my brain. Ah. Look how white I look now compared to in the video. Girls in the world, but there's only one. And we walk off into the sunset and we just slightly brush hands. Just ever so slightly. Oh, what's this? Oh, the official lyric video. Check that out. Now, I've watched that a million times. I don't need to watch it again. <laughs> wow, well, if you haven't seen the video already, I hope you guys like it. I like it. I like it a lot. I'm going to go on Twitter and I'm going to answer your questions. If you have any questions. Okay. Okay. Where am I? <clears throat> Somebody said don't, I'm laughing too much. I don't know what you're laughing at. Oh, 
I'm going to be following people as well that tweet the pre-order print screen. Ben's priority. Well, oh, really? Strange name. Followed. <whistles> How sick is the photo behind me? Is a photo? Oh, is it? Oh yeah. It's all right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. But you apparently followed it, so I'm gonna um, bought a single, so I am gonna follow you just like that. <clears throat> Sprinkle of UJ, good name. Followed. Are there any questions? Do I like Bridget uh, Mendler? She did uh, that song. Ready or not, here I come. Da da da. Lick my bum. Yeah, it's a good song. Uh, she's cool. I don't really know much of her other stuff. I've heard a few things. I think it's cool. She's cool. Touch my body. Darcy official. You are officially followed. Ready or not, here I come. Bad at bay, the night is young. I will find you. Ready or not. Da da da. Give me one sec. <clears throat> I'm from the US, so I pre ordered the album. Shout out. Hell yeah, Tomlin Socks. I'm in text about the music video. <clears throat> Oh, uh, by the way, yeah. If you're if you're like from out of the UK, if you want to get the album, you can actually get it. All the album, the uh, like it's like an EP sort of single thing, and you can get like signed ones, uh, which I think ship everywhere. So if you guys, if you guys want one, you can get it there. I'll post the link after the live stream to where you can get it from. Ready or not, will there be a behind the scenes? of a billion girls video from Becky Hassel. Yeah, there's gonna be behind the scenes. Uh it's pretty funny. The director's name was Nigel Dick, so he had a chair which said I don't know what the chair said. Something to do Only Dicks can sit in this chair. You have to be a dick to sit in this chair or something like that. You know, Nigel Dick. You know, he loves it himself. Gotta do it. And uh as you can imagine I spent most of the day on it, so Ready or not, here I come. Do I prefer Do It All Over Again or A Billion Girls? Uh, I think I prefer A Billion Girls. I think so. Not that I don't like Do It All Over Again. I think I like Billion Girls better. Missia Fox Vamps. You got followed. George, uh, George Shells, on a scale of one to pizza, how much do you love me? Well, considering you pre-ordered the new single, A Billion Girls, I pizza you. Superman or Batman? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Uh, Batman. 
I don't know, there's always something a little bit like wimpy about Superman. I found. Batman was kind of badass. He's been through shit. Uh, Jord 6. Followed! Do you or do you love your Irish fans? From Dinah, I'm a J Cat. Yes. Yes, I do. Especially the ones that brought up a single. Do you guys want to know a little secret? <clears throat> I know it's not video related, but I'm currently not in my hotel room. I mean, I'm in this hotel, but I'm like a few doors down. It's my tour manager, Pauls. He's gone out with, with like some of the guys from a band to a... Uh, to uh, do whatever, they've gone out, it's like a bar or something, I don't know, but I was like, I'd rather stay in and hang out with the foxes, and um, yeah, so his room had better internet connection than mine, I did not want to do another live stream where it fails miserably and I freeze and I'm like, can anyone hear me, uh, so any minute he could walk in. Maybe with a lady. Who knows? I think he knows I'm in here. Man, yeah, I did just take his key. I don't know. What are you doing in here? That's what he'll say. Can Smile be a single? Please, I'll die happy if so. Okay. Just for you. Just for you. Might just have to. Ready, huh? Are you gonna notice me tonight here for Jukestin? You tell me. Amy JLS Belieber. Well, oh, thanks for pre ordering it. It's really cool that you guys are pre ordering. I was, uh, I was never very good with pre ordering singles. I always used to wait for it to come out. Unless I was actually like a really big fan. If it was like a band or an artist, like, like Bruno Mars, I pre-ordered his album. <clears throat> How do you feel when my girl ignored you? Um, well, I quite enjoyed it. I mean, it wasn't real. It wasn't real. She wasn't really ignoring me. It was like a scripted thing. But, um, yeah, I was heartbroken. So, you know, I was all like, damn, shawty, the billion girls, but I'm the only one you and I, you know, the only shawty I want, you know, she on the phone, like, mm, like talking to her girls. And I'm like, man, okay, man, I'm just gonna go. Ready or not? Thank you, George's Monkey, pre ordering it. I played a really cool show tonight in Dublin. Dublin. I'm in Ireland, where everybody says tanks. Tanks instead of thanks. Or if you're me, you say thanks with an F. Llamas or alpacas? Uh, llamas, they're kind of straightforward. Alpacas, they're cool as well, but I think they're slightly simpler, actually. I think, I think llamas have seen conflict. They've been through stuff. Faith D. Hammer 1, what's your favourite colour? I don't know, it changes all the time. I like blue, I like purple, I like red. Red's my favourite lately. I've been wearing this, she blue and red together. <clears throat> I've been wearing this really cool stage outfit, like, I don't know if you guys have seen any, like, pictures or videos or you've seen the shows, but I have some really cool stage outfits, which is, like, a bit of, like, red and stuff. Uh, it's got, like, bits of red and it's, like, denim jacket. It's really cool. It's got, like, red leather on it. Um, Superman or Batman or Spider-Man? If you don't know this, I'm disappointed. It does not need an answer. Spider-Man. Please visit Leeds someday. I was in Leeds the other day. Should have come. Ready or not? Hannah Louise. Followed. So let me know what you guys think of the video as well. 
uh, obviously. I hope you like it. What's my favorite pie flavor from Rahima? Well, right now it's key lime pie because I had key lime pie and it was the best pie I've had. Well, I don't know. I've just always heard a lot about key lime pie and I really want to try it. And eventually, I got to the other day. It was everything I hoped it'd be. Was everything I hoped it'd be. Mmm, key lime pie. I've been eating too much cake lately. Ah, man. Too much. Way too much. Um, what cakes I had today? Today I had cake. It had, like, beer in it. It was like, because we're in Ireland, they're, like, celebrating Guinness beer. And it was like, it was like, um, chocolate Guinness cake. It was okay. There was no key lime bar. Oh man, I've got to go shopping tomorrow morning because I left. I don't know if you guys know this. You don't. <clears throat> There's a story for you. So not only this morning did I decide to leave my guitar at home, so I had to rent one for the gig tonight with the wanted. I also I left my suitcase in the terminal at the airport. I was on the phone. I called my tour manager. I was like, dude. Like he was already in Dublin. I was like, dude, sorry, I've left my guitar at home. Is there something you can do about it? You know. Bonjour, Amelia Fox. What's up? Can you help me out? <laughs> and then um and then because I was worried about that, and then Bobby goes, We're gonna be late. We're gonna be late, it's gonna close, the thing's gonna close, whatever, the gate or whatever. And I was like, Oh crap. So I literally just started running like crazy. And um a little, little hand luggage suitcase was left behind with my stage t-shirts and the rest of my clothes. All I have is like this. I have any other underwear. I've got to go buy some tomorrow in the morning. But man, I've got to get a cab. I've got to get a cab somewhere to go buy some like some panties. That, that seems, that seems, seems cray. <clears throat> Jessica Christie, you're followed. Thanks for pre-ordering. Do I like Japan? Yeah, I'd love to go there. Now, <clears throat> Lee as well just asked me, what height am I? This is interesting. I thought I was 5'8", and I said that the other day, and someone went, 5'8", you're like taller than that, and I was like, really? I, I don't know. I think I'm 5'9". I think I'm a strong 5'9". I, I wouldn't say 5'10". I'd say 5'9.5". But I could be wrong. I know nothing about like measurement and heights, etc. You know? You know? Cammy Beebs. How are you? I'm good. I'm real good. It's midnight. I'm as tired as you guys. But, um... I had a really cool show tonight, so I'm good. When will you do your own tour from Pitt's Feet Sykes? Uh, like, really soon. I think it definitely, like, this year, like, around the album, I'll definitely be doing, like, some headline shows. Which will be really cool. Queen of <laughs> Geisha. Can I sneak into your bed? You can sneak. You have to sneak. You can jump. <laughs> Grr, trying to get you to notice me a lot. Official, official Alicia A. It's everything I hoped to be. Uh, Kiyoshi Have you tried to cover a Japanese song? There are a lot of cool and great Japanese songs That's true I don't know how good I'd be But, you know, I love Japan I'd love to just go to Japan And, like, you know, get a fan base 
it's really cool there. I'd love to go out there. It's a great country. Um, <clears throat> I, I don't know. I don't know if I'm really... I can try to pull it off. I remember that I used to listen to, like, a couple times, a uh, Avril Lavigne's girlfriend, but Japanese was like, Hi, hi, yo, yo. Something. I don't know. And, uh, yeah, last night I was listening to... I was meant to be sleeping to get up for my flight, but instead I was listening to Spanish version of uh, A Talk Day by Jason Derulo. It's quite funny. I'm going to put it on. Check it out. <clears throat> Jason Derulo Talk Day Spanish. It's really funny. I mean, it's not funny if you're Spanish, but I found it really funny. I was like, dude, do you speak Spanish? I wonder how that sounds to Spanish people. Jason. If you can hear it, let me know. Jason. I'm not gonna lie, I prefer that. I just, I just decided I like that. I'm buying that if I can. I'm iTunes in that for sure. Skulls official. Me go and follow you. Zaya Oreo, can I drop kick you? If you want. Always wanted to be drop kicked. That made no sense. <laughs> Miles favourites. Followed. Thanks for ordering. <laughs> Powerful hood. Been waiting for this all day and you ignore me. I love you. I love you too. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to ignore you. Never meant to hurt you. My favourite wanted song. You'll follow, by the way. Thanks for pre-ordering. My favourite wanted song. I don't know. <clears throat> like, today I watched the show, like, properly. Like, because I've never managed to, like, watch the whole show on this tour. Because we've always, like, got to go off afterwards. I only managed to catch a few songs. But today I watched, like, literally all of it. And it was, like, it was really good. I don't know what my favourite song is. I really like Gold Forever. Gold Forever is really cool. Someday stay go forever. I've always liked that since I was like a youth, a youth, a youngster. Still, I'm a youngster. How are you not tired? Follow me. Done like chicken. Madeline de oh, oh something. Do you like One Direction? E. Yes, I do like One Direction. They're yeah, very cool band. <laughs> Someone apparently got Domino's to follow me. Really? You got Domino's to follow me? At Elliot Shari underscore. That. That. That's true, that's special. I'm gonna check right now. Domino's. If Domino's is following me, I might believe you. Whoa! Wow, I can't believe I don't follow Domino's. Follow it back. I mean, it's Domino's UK, it's still good, but. Man, I'm fangirling a little bit. Fanboying. 
can't believe that. Guys. Guys! Domino's Pizza followed me! Started from the bottom. Now we're here. But a booty don't need explaining. It's true. Jason makes a fair point. The booty does not need explaining. You know? Speaks for itself. Uh. <clears throat> Glittery George, if you could have any accent, what would it be? And please, could you follow me? Mm. Okay, it's yours, I see. Get the single. Uh, I like my accent. I really wouldn't want to change it. Apparently, sometimes, I... Apparently, I don't know, sometimes I accidentally slip into a bit of an American accent when I'm on stage. Now, I, I became conscious of that, a bit, little bit self-conscious of that, and uh, I decided to change it, and today I was like, I am so British. It's just because I, I say, like, stupid phrases and stuff, and it just kind of kind of sounds American, and whenever I do a stupid voice on stage, I just do it in a kind of, what's going on, sort of accent, and it, I guess it sounds a bit American. Me sorry. But, you know, I like my accent. I like, uh, I like being British. British. If you see this, smile and be happy. That's all I need. <laughs> I have school tomorrow. I have to get a party. Please follow me. Sure thing. Thanks for pre-ordering the single. The video was really cool to film. Uh... You know, I'm going to have a behind the scenes coming out about it. But yeah, it was really cool. It was a really fun video. Wow, this re-neck is just getting so low. Um, yeah, it was a really cool video to film. And uh, I'm really happy how it turned out. And I hope you guys like it. I'm going to, right after this, I'm going to post a couple links for you guys. If you want to get the signed CD, especially if you live out of the UK and you want to get a signed CD, you can get it. It's um, literally from myplaydirect.com slash Elliot-Fox. I tweeted it uh, seven minutes ago. So check it out. It's cool. It's like kind of a bit more personal, you know? A personal... Like a personal pizza. Also, I'm gonna tweet the link to the video. A box of billion girls. But a booty don't need explaining. When you talk dirty to me. And whether it's tomorrow or the day after, I'm gonna do some more follow stuff or I'm just gonna follow you a bunch of you guys. For doing stuff to do the video. If you haven't seen the video yet, I will post the link to it afterwards. And just over like the next however long, I'm just still gonna follow a bunch of you guys that tweet me print screens of your pre orders of a billion girls off iTunes or off my Play Direct or like you know, the store online. So, yes, sir. So, yeah, thanks so much for your support, guys. As always, like. I'm like having such a great time right now and it's all thanks to the people that are supporting me and continuously believing in me. <clears throat> and yeah, I'm just feel so happy to finally be on tour, especially a big tour like this. It's just like a dream come true. And I always say I wouldn't be here without you guys. So I'll always forever be grateful for your support. So uh Yeah. Thanks guys. And I will catch you on the flip side.
flip side. I wonder if I've got a funny picture I can show you guys before I go. Let me see. I've always got funny pictures on my phone. When you talk to it to me. Do I have a funny picture? Oh, there you go. This is funny. I'll probably tweet this. Excuse me, sir. Do you have a moment to talk about Jesus Christ? Yes. Yes, I do. I uh, Before I go, I've got a story for you guys. <clears throat> Basically, once some Jehovah's Witnesses came, there was one woman, she was like 30s or 40s, and then the other one was like 80s. And uh, her eye kept watering, and I was like, are you okay, have I sad? And she was like, oh no, it's just a problem I have in that eye water. And I was like, are you sure if I've upset you? Anyway, um, so first of all, I opened the door in a towel. I don't know why I was in it. Oh, I was having a shower, obviously. And then, the I, I, I wasn't really interested in being a Jehovah's Witness. Not that there's, I have a problem with it, I just wasn't, just wasn't really, you know. I'm not, I'm not like, really religious like that, but, yeah, I decided to speak with them, just because it was company, and I was bored, and I was like 16, and I was like, yeah, please, come inside, come inside, and they, they ended up talking with me for like two hours, that story went nowhere, okay, bye, I love you guys, peace out, foxes, and yeah, I'll see you soon. If you haven't seen the video, I'm going to be posting it right now. And creep, keep tweeting me your pre-order uh, print screens off iTunes or MyPlayDirect or anything like that. And uh, I'll do my best to follow you all. Thanks so much for your support. I love you guys. I'll see you real soon. Peace. Ah!